Alrighty, everyone. It is time for the grand finale of our Turok Any% Percent version 1.1 speedrunning tutorial. We have reached the climax, if you will. So to begin, you will spawn in here. If you need the health, go ahead and take it. But uh, really, with how far away you can do damage to Thunder, you should be fine. Just skip ahead and start picking up weapons. There are two strategies for Campaigner. Uh, one is good, one is stupidly aggressive that saves maybe half a second and most likely kills your run. <laughs> um, guess who came up with the second one? Um, and anyways, it's just, in, in my opinion, it's not worth it. The stupidly aggressive strat just uses uh, weapon swapping, which is the, the weapon swapping glitch to move from your rocket launcher to your auto shoddy. The problem with that, though, is it's a very good way to A, miss shots and lose time, and B, do a tremendous amount of damage to yourself. So I don't use that in runs anymore, but uh, I will show it after I show the regular version. Um, campaigner hits very hard, but with how quick we are and how... His attacks don't have a lot of range unless you move far from him, which you do not do. Do not move far away from him, because otherwise he jumps and starts doing all sorts of shit that costs you time. So don't do that. The idea is just stay close to him, bait him, hit and run. So you enter this fight, take a step back. You get three free shots with the rocket. I take four, because I usually get a good... I usually... He just charges you, and I get... And I bait out an attack and do damage. And I'm willing to take the health loss. So if, if you don't want to do that, you don't have to. That's how I do it. So we take a step back. One, two, three, and then four. He'll get close. Let's see what attack. That's the attack we want. Squeeze in two, going close. And see, he's not doing a ton of damage. It's mostly making sure my own rockets uh, don't hit me too hard. Want to do something, dude? All right. You can switch to your auto shoddy uh, with one rocket left if you hit them all. And then just run in circles, and that's the fight. Um, so like I said, stick close to him. Stick close, not so close that you're going to tank all your rocket damage and kill yourself. No, 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 no. Do not do that. But do not get too far away from him, because then he starts, like I said, he jumps around. He has an attack where he teleports and attacks from above, and it's just terrible. It's just terrible. I'm gonna alt F4 out of there just so we can get back to it quicker. Um, and really that's the fight. Um, <laughs> to be honest, I'm probably one of the worst players <laughs> at, the, at, the, at the fight. I, I, Campaigner and I just do not get along. Um, yeah, so I'll try and show you the stupidly aggressive strats. Basically you fire a rocket and then switch and then just keep firing. I'll try and show it. Most likely I'm going to die, I'll be honest, but that's alright. I'll show it to you anyways. So fire, weapon swap, and now we are locked in. We cannot stop firing grenade uh, rockets. Oh, with this pattern, it's actually going to be okay, though. Oh, yep, see, and then he jumps. And then when he jumps, you can't keep, yeah. Yep, so that didn't go well, as you can see. We're not even going to kill him with these... The nice thing at the end of the fight is, uh, he has no mobility. So if you do get him down, just run around in circles. He can still hit you. I learned that the hard way once, but, uh, I didn't lose my run, but I lost three seconds on a world record run at the time. But, uh, yeah. Um, yeah, not a whole lot to add to this fight. Um, I guess I'll show you what happens if you run away from him. But yeah, really it's just bait and switch, have your rockets out, get your three free shots. Um, if you want to do it like me, take that fourth one. Like I said, you should have more health than 105. This is an old save file where I didn't use proper health routing. So you should have, you know, 100, 130 behind your armor, 140. Um, yeah, so if you want to just tank that, that fourth shot off the start, do it. Remember, take a step back right away, because otherwise you will hurt yourself. Two, 
three, four. Do the move, do the move. Yeah, see, that's what you want. That's a perfect start right there. That's half your rockets. Yeah. Okay, now I'm just gonna run away. See, then he starts jumping, and then he'll keep chain jumping because he keeps knocking you away. Let's see if I can get him to do it. This attack. That is the one you don't want him to do. So, if you lose containment, sometimes you'll get lucky, and he'll just warp right in front of you, and that's nice. But uh, you can't guarantee it, and it's this late in the run, you don't want to bank on it. So, definitely do not rely on it. Stay close, hit and run. Watch your health, because you are going to be hitting yourself with your own rockets. And yeah, that is Turok, everyone. Um, I don't know. Shoutouts to the Turok community. Growth, Slayer, Mr. Monkey, Bismuth, Bok Basoop. Uh, yeah, everyone else. Sorry, I'm pretty new to the community, so I don't know all the people who are on the ground level, but... Uh, they, they are the ones who uh, really put all the the elbow grease into this run, so to speak. So, uh, yeah. Yeah, I just want to do a quick thank you to them. Thank you for watching. I hope your runs go well. And, uh, yeah, please feel free to get at me with any questions. I am happy to help anyone out. Yeah, and that's it. I'm Pale. I'm out. Later, everyone.